Well, folks, I'm going to do a little update. There's my little varmint that's always pestering me. Yep. I still haven't got me a slingshot or a baby gun one day. <laughs> Anyways, I wanted to give you an update on this beautiful plant. This is what Glenn gave me. Doesn't seem to have grown any. But this leaf got moved, of course. Probably by that little varmint. But it seems like this is still up in the way it's supposed to be. Um, it has been raining and raining and raining for a week now. I was complaining because it was getting too dry. And now it's too wet. Slosh, slosh, slosh. In the yard out there, look it. It's all sloshy. Can't even walk out there, but check this out. These peppers are doing beautifully. Y'all, I don't even eat these hot peppers, but I give them to the neighbors. That one's got something on it. Looks like a bite or something. But I can also dry them and give them to my birds. Because they like them. So, let's see. What else can I update you on? I think tomorrow I'm going to plant the, the white uh, dragon fruit and the uh, plumeria. But these are the pineapples. And they're not totally dead yet. They're still green and nice and happy. I uh, put some tool around that one because I don't want that getting to the uh, to the uh, varmints. And I had uh, somebody help me. I don't know if I told you guys this or not. I had somebody help me uh, with the stuff I'll show you. <laughs> Cut it up and uh, he knocked my pineapple over. So I had to stake it up. But that one over there is looking beautiful. And I don't know if this is going to make it. This is the uh, sugar apple. That one and that one over there. They both look a little dead. It could be because of the rain, you know. Too much rain for them. I don't know. We'll see. That is the... Uh, Mm. pecan that uh, he gave me Glenn gave me and check this out y'all remember when I planted all those uh, seeds from the pomegranates I mean not pomegranates lord have mercy my brain ain't working those are from papayas so I'm going to pot those up tomorrow hopefully and um to weed i think yep that's a weed my beans that i found growing in the chair are still still alive so we'll see but uh i still need to put up those two posts over there but i want to go and get one of those hammers post hammers and uh See if we can't get it growing good everything's looking pretty good and see how beautiful stacked lumber yeah some of it still got a few nails and such in it but I'll have to get those out at least I got it apart and stacked nicely so it didn't look crazy out here I did pull up here, big mistake with all this uh, rain, and it put ruts in the ground there. So, see out there where I put the rut there too. It looks bad, but it'll 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 fix itself, I'm sure. Um, I had to stand up this one. Got to find another stake and pull this one over towards me. So. I'm because it's kind of leaning. 
but everything's doing pretty good. Um, let's go over here. I want to show you this over here. Look at how beautiful the black sapote is. It's getting heavy though. They're getting really, really heavy. So pretty soon, <laughs> all them limbs are going to be drooping like that one. Um, my red vermilions are dying out. And oh well. <laughs> I don't know if these guys are gonna make it or not. I planted them. That's the Mexican sunflower. But I'm trying to see if I see any fruit up here. It's hard. It's hard to see them. They hide from you. They really do. So, I watched a show um, on TV called Homestead Rescue, and they were, the guy on there that was the beekeeper, I mean, the guy on there keeps bees, and he said that the best honey comes from guava. Uh, I think he said... See, what was the other one? I want to say, I think he said papaya, but I'm not positive. He said three different things, and I had two of those three things. I'm going to watch it again just to see what he said. But look at these blooms. Hopefully, I have more fruit. Hopefully. We shall see. It is starting to rain, of course. Now, I was going to cut this passion vine down, but I decided not to. Good thing I decided not to because, check it out up there. There's green vine up there. So, they should be having some fruit sometime soon, I hope. We'll see. And of course, the pears. <laughs> so, I don't know. I don't know if this tree will ever fruit, but I'm looking forward to getting some pineapple guava off this if I ever find any fruit that is close to being ripe. I'll be getting that and tasting it. But it's been raining crazy, crazy for the last week. Anyways, so oh, I need to harvest the moringa leaves um, soon too and cut that back. Hopefully it'll sprout back out again before winter and I want to get some more of these seeds. Um, Check them seeds out. <laughs> I don't know why they slowed down. That was weird. And this tree, this uh, star fruit carambola, is fruiting just a few. Uh, it's later. So this is probably maybe, might be ready by the time that I come on the trip for my picnic. And it looks like this uh, spearmint's trying to spread. Uh, I still need to move that, that plant there. I can't believe I haven't moved it yet. That's, uh, I want to say that looks like the, um, 
Mexican sunflower that Mac and Patty sent me the seeds to, which is beautiful too. So we'll see. I don't know. Anyways, got a lot going on, got a lot to do. Very thankful for what I've got. Even this little guy has got some fruit and flowers setting. This is my miracle fruit that I haven't planted yet. And of course, blackberry bushes. Bought me a lot of blackberry bushes. Hopefully I can get them in the ground. And uh, that right there is my um, Barbados cherry that we air layered. It's looking nice. I just repotted some um, elderberry bushes in those little pots there. I took them out of the square pots that behind, sitting behind it. And uh, also, I've got some uh, papayas. I think those are a different variety than what I have, so I'm going to stick to those, I think. I haven't made up my mind. I might keep those. But I'm going to pot some of those others up and see if I can't uh, find somebody that wants them at the picnic. And more blackberry and fig. and I forget what this said it was. Some type of some type of mint, I think it said. But wait, I don't know. <laughs> it's probably just a weed. And look at here, I got a stink bulb on there. I hate these little guys. They hang around. Man, does he ever stink. Hopefully he'll drown. Doesn't look like he can get out of there. I don't know. I don't know if they can climb plastic or not. That's mean, isn't it? Oh well. This is some purslane. Looking really pretty. I got some seeds here that I may be able to spread. This is a thicker, nicer purslane. So, that's a nice uh, find. Uh, I love finding little things in the garden. So, I'm going to take you back here and check out the uh, um, peanuts and things in the overgrown food garden. Actually, I think I'm going to stand right here and show you. They're getting yellower by the minute. I don't know if that's time to... Oh, 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 looky here. I got me, got me a tomato. Made a plant looks like it's a dying back. Nice surprise though. Beautiful tomato. My Go figure. Oscar's gotta run his mouth. The um oh, I'm sorry, guys. The, the grape is finally starting to crawl up the vine. The uh, beans are looking nicer. Starting to crawl over. And this grapevine is starting to grow up, too. I need to get this put in, in the thing. It's starting to grow up the, the um, trellis, too which makes me very, very happy. And of course, my little varmints are out of the 
backyard where they belong because I left the gate open. So, they are a mess, let me tell you. Look at all of them, wet, drowned little brats. So anyways, uh, this is my beautiful overgrown garden. Yes, I've got a lot of work to do and hopefully in the morning I can get to it since I don't have to go anywhere tomorrow. I can get my mind set on that. I should probably be in the house instead of out here putzing around. Uh, the potatoes are coming up nicely. <laughs> and of course I've got weeds too. Yep, I gotta get out here and weed. But I need, uh, everything's so overgrown right now that I'm definitely going to need, um, what do you call them? Spray. Spray, spray, spray. All the spray that I can get. And I'm thinking about planting these in the beds here. Even though it's not the... They're starting to root on the bottom. I should, probably shouldn't have done that until I was ready to plant them. But look at that Malabar spinach. Doesn't it look good? Looks real good. All this overgrown thread. Now David uses these weeds to keep from getting um, um, what's it called? Uh, kidney stones. He's looked it up and says they help fight kidney stones, but you know, we're not doctors and we don't claim to be, but we like, we like hearing these things, even if they're old wives' tales, right? Anything will help. If it don't if it don't hurt you eating it, might as well try it, right? Anyways. Can't remember what this one was. Oh, catnip. Surprised the neighbors cats ain't found it. I can't remember what this is, but I'm gonna have to look that up. I don't think that's, I think that's something that I planted. Go figure, I pulled one up. Anyways, oh, crazy, crazy. Those are doing really well. But yeah, see how crazy it is? And my um, comfrey barrel is ready to start watering with again. Oh, it smells so divine. This right here, I can't wait to come out here in the morning. I Hopefully it will dry off so I can get some seeds. Because this is my favorite. This is the lemon... Uh, basil and I don't want to shake it too much because it'll seed out on the ground instead of in my bag that I want to put it in but I am going to harvest that and uh, then I've got some right behind it to harvest so and these are some more uh, um, Oh my goodness gracious. Sunflower seeds. Oh, sunflowers. I planted in there and hopefully they'll turn out really nice. Um, I've got so much to work to do. But right now, just take one day at a time and try to get what I get done. Check out my babies back here. 
Uh oh, somebody's upside down. I wonder why she's upside down.